mocha e ka ba nako e thabisang ha holo bophelong ba motho ha o le mocha o na le bophelo ba ha o ka ufela di dilemo tse ngata ka pela ha o o na le ditogo tse golo tse etsang hore o natefelwe ha o na hana ka dintho tsohle tse bophelo bo tshwaretseng tsona bo ka mosong ba ha o se o sa se batleng nako ena ya bophelo ba ha o ke mathata a mangata a dikoloto ka jeno re shebane le pali ya Gerald Ramuani o hlankana ya dilemo tse mashume a mabedi ya iphumanang a sa sebetse me a le dikolotong tse ngata tse moimetseng ha holo ke nna marona khwele ya le amohela ho rents with sense Madume ka lapeng ga le amohela le nane hong le leng hape la rents with sense mona ho SABC2 ka jeno re kopana le Gerald Ramwabi re tlo le ka ho bona hore dintho di le di a senye ha kae ma emong a haya a chelete ha ho monate ho hang ho ba dikolotong tse ngata tse buima ha ho lo jwang ha o sa le motsha ya qalang bophelo ba hae ke tswale tsim pumalanga ka holela le sotho ke lete ho bane ngone waka she didn't want me ga benyane neng ke hole ke wa se go afela so wa ga benyane neng o tla ngodisa ke thute se sotho so ba tsile no ka enda ba kudula le bona but first me ga lenda ba ga ke bona ba tsile mpele and then ka mba o mmono ga latela na le ngwana so amenya le um because there's two of us jwalo ka batsha ba ba Gerald Liena o na le ditoro my ambitions in life thoughts are gone when I'm while Kimo Tlo ga benyane na I'm quite creative I'm good with my hands painting uh just general creativeness of a person I'm quite good with my hands and also idea wise I think the idea that in terms of how I can put things together the grand so in the future All I know is I'm going to be famous and the getting there part for me is what's going to be most difficult but I think it's also going to be fun. Hane a fumana scholarship sa we tuta fashion designing. We la fumana di ntho di motsamaela hantle ha holo. I went to the co- uh, fashion college and that was after my matric year. I went there the like a few months later I'm like ke batla go etsa course thing thing and give money school salon on google so how do i get in and i knew i benya hakena chalet first of all i can't afford the school so ba ga benya nene mbana le bursary a three year so i applied it everything in a by shoka um and then yeah ba ga tla benya nene ke ba mpha four three year uh, scholarship ka bo madimabi jwalo ka bo ngata ba rona ma emo a haya a chelete a ile a mohlodisa go tswelisa thuto tsa haya pele me wa haya wila monkela lomo go ga tswelle pele ka dithuto tsa haya empa sena ha se a muthusa ha kala and then ka mogana go then the finances ya ga benyane ne ke tlame go ke pata le go ga masela ntotsa go ka and all that type of thing finally got too much for me and i wasn't able ga benyane ne kifuma na mosebetsi wa bobedi ga benyane ne ka khona re ke ke sustain financially without having to ask me wa ka for chalete who didn't have chalete and then batho ba ntlo mona na ka le tsha ga benyane ne ma mphetse to bana le bona never struggle at the time ga benyane ne ba ka ba ka support uh to such an extent ga chalete a bona go tswelisa dithuto tsa ha o pele ke leano le letle ha holo ho sa gathalatse hore o monyane kapa o moholo ha fela o ka gona go patala ha re ke re boneng hore re hloka ho tseba eng ka di student loan ka se student leen ek se basis waar die banke vir jou sal sal geld leen om 'n sekere kwalifikasie weet agter die agter die reg te kry um, en ons leen vir jou die geld basis om weet jou boeke te kan betaal jou klasgelde um, en terwyl jy studeer um, dis 'n leening wat saam met jou ouers sal aangegaan word so terwyl jy studeer uh, word net die rente op die leening gedelg um, as jy dan die dag jou kwalifikasie voltooi 
um, gee die banken vir jou gewoonlijke grasieperiode voordat jy daarom nou hoef te begin een rente en kapitaal terugbetaal. Um, so weet jy, jy krijg daarom een bykie kans om, om eers waar te soek uh, en, en om dan jou uh, lening te begin terugbetaal. Hoba le tuto, le tsebo, mababi le taulo, tsebe diso, kadimo, le tse di nse ngata, tsa chelete, hobo shokwa ha holo. Ho tseba hore chelete e sebe tsa joang, le ho tseba ka di banka li di reiti tsa tswala tsa di loun. Ho famo nyeta omotle, wa ho tseba ho laula, lo tswara chelete ya hao hantle. Eka ba ba chaba sa itekane lang, ba ka ya tsa eeng, ho tswe lisa di tuto tsa wana pele, ka ntle lo hui puma na bali di kolotong. Le nane hong le leng le le leng, gena le nako, ew si tibi sa rona se fang ba tu ba sa itekane lang, di ke le tso tsa ho sebe di sa lo ho laula chelete ya bona. Hallo, my naam is Karin Smit en ek is a Suid-Afrikaner met a gestreemdheid. Financiële kwesties is net so belangrik vir my en persoene met gestreemdhede, soos vir alle mense. Vandag gesels ek met julle oor gestreemdes en die onderwijs. Meeste gestreemdes woon ook nie ter so herre instellings by nie, as gevolg van beperkte finansies, vervoerprobleme en die negatieve houding van ouders. Die 2011 census het bepaal dat meer as een derde van alle kinders wat erge mobiliteits- en functionering probleme ervaar, nie school bijwoon nie. Soms is dit selfs die gestreemde persoon wat die negatieve houding het en vraag, hoekom moet ek studeer as ek in elk geval nie gaan werk krij nie? Gestreemd of nie, niemand sal met so een negatieve houding verkom in die lewe nie. Focus eerder op wat een goeie opvoeding jou kan bied. Vooral nou dat daar heel wat beerse, financiële hulp en toegankelijke universiteit beskikbaar is. Indien jy nie voltijds by die universiteit of college wil studeer nie, kan jy lang afstand onderrug doen dier INISA of een ander institutie. Besoek gerust die National Student Financial Aid Schemes webwerf om inlichting te bekom oor beerse wat aangebied word vir persoene met gestreemdhede. En onthou, op die einde van die dag is dit jou houding wat jou lewe bepaal en nie jou gestreemdheid nie. Neem aksie en maak jou drome waar. Hou wat laut sebaad die nklats ene? Kabotlalo, et ala website ya roo. Brandswithsense.co.za Kapa oe tele Facebook page ya roo. Kamo ga papa tzu. Ketwa lad eeni, kapa nia Gerald. Mi hun tue hore hona le tshepo kabo pelo ba hai. Kale amo hela hape, who rants with sense. Le nane ho le shabanang, li di tarolo, ze fapaneen, ho raro la matata agona a chelet. Ri tuta ka matata atlang, li di koloto, ka pali amo slanka na ya bitwang Gerald Ramuabi. Ya i puma nang ak ene hara di koloto, ze ngata, ze buima, ka u fiti sisa. Ho se nye ile kai, eba ho e tsa hetzeng, ho gomo slanka na, Eo ai pumana ali di kolotong ali di lomo tsa mashume a mabedi fela. No ba ke sebeditse mono ha waka berry from June 2013 up until early December. So ke sebeditse teng from kana go nofishala kana go eno and ka bona ga benyane hey I need to keep in touch with my friends and my family. So ka ga ka phone uh, it was an S3 mini and I got it on contract. Three months down the line, phone I Phone I contract dating. At the time, I was it was about 169 per month, which was, I calculated at the time, something a little over 3,000. So it made sense because I that I thought was enough at the time, but then, and then I thought, oh, I'm so over this place now. Kadula, ke go lang toke tsa ngwedi. Itse ka mogao ho mono. Ka fumana 
Musebezi Kaga Omocha at a call center. I bought myself a second phone, which was a S5. And Leona kind got on contract again. S5 Niki Fumana, it was around about 450 per month. And then when I did the calculation for the phone for over 24 months, because that's how long the agreement I signed was, was like 11,125 uh, rand, roughly, I think. So, I thought, I earn so much money, it's probably not gonna be a problem. Little did I know. Kabu Madimabi, Koloto sa Gerald, Hadia Fella Moon. William Kakreto, Yaung alone, who adds ever hope at a student loan, sa high. So, I'm going to go to the African Bank for about 3000 And the reason for the loan is that I'm going to go to the African Bank. I'm going to go to the African Bank. I'm going to go to the at this very expensive fashion college. So, it was that. And then, Yona, with interest, I think it came. Just probably under 4,000, I think. So it's a camera homono kanano. Actually, you know what? If I can get this much, why don't I try again? And it was just like uh, I want to try again, Fela. And that one I got with um, Capitec. And loan in your Capitec on it was about 3,000 or less. And then it's like a fumani. I started out using it maybe to just like get ticket down in Kiyama Sibetsi. And then it went from ticket down Sibetsi to I want to have lunch where I've never had lunch before Masibetsi. And then I went to do chill in town. Fumani, I could and I had the money to do so. And then it's a camera no kuhakira you know, the money was up. Mens krijg twee soorte skuld. Um, nodige skuld en onnodige skuld. Nodige skuld is iets soos jou huis. Huislening, um, motorfinansiering, um, studielenings. Dis nodige skuld. Onnodige skuld is die skuld wat ons allemaal heet. Cellfone, kleren, kredietkaarte, persoonlijke lenings. Geld wat ons gaan uittaal so wat ons kan gaan uiteet. Dis onnodige skuld. I was or rather when I sat down, So it was like maybe 21,000. That's Kolo to sell or And I'm not paying anything on any debt. If you have a look at debt consolidation, what you can do is you can take one loan to consolidate all your debt. If you have lots of loans with micro lenders, for example, you owe one person 5,000, another person 3,000, and a further person 10,000. That's 18,000, but it's three separate loans over sometimes six months left, 12 months, and 18 months. You could consolidate all those into one loan, whereby you go and you take a loan for the 18,000, and you, could, you settle all your other debts, and you only have one loan, and you put it over a period that you're happy with, but you have to realize that you're gonna be paying interest on that amount of money for that period. Kitsena din toso tlame hang hu di shokomel, how it's a debt consolidation loan. O bea tokomel, ho di fefu. Badiri babanchi, banagana ore, olefa, kira kadini. Hanti, tefo, kiletsen, kipoelo, chedi fisherile. Di kampani di dira chelete katsela ye. Di toko bea shedi ore ubulo ke le go sekeja bo kae ka khwe. Di to okeja nako ya kadimu. Mo ekere olefa tlase ka khwe. Khante olefa kodimu kanako etele. Bukaoni ulebelele kadimu. Ya tefo etlase ka khwe. Enaro didi tifelo. Rosa, Tevi, Gadi, Tees and Seas. Ranchi, 
ba dirishi ba gapeletsa go lokisha di chelete ka go nyatsa nako le maemo a di T's and C's tše di fihlilegilego go tumelano ya mokitlana bula kwano ga botse lebelela dikotlo tsa go busheletsa go patela tefo ye e kukumogilego le ditukisho tsa di rate o se ke wa tsenela tumelelano ye o sa ikwishishego ya di T's and C's ke tokelo ya gago go tseba di tokelo go se itlame go kwishisha tlhaloso e etlejego ka leleme le o le kwa go thibela gore o se wele moleteng wa sekoloto ke go sae mabenkeleng gafetja gafetja o se ke wa saena di pampiri le jajing leo o dirilego khopelo ka lona ya sekoloto go nthishisha gore o dirile dinyakishisho butjisha o hoetse se se leng makgonthe se o sinyaka go sabe le tsela ya go shumana le sekoloto dikadimo tše tlaleletšego di fetsa go kaona fatsa siemo sa nakwa tharollo ya nakwana e tlisha bothata bya nako e tele ge o tsea kadimo ya tishetse go ba engwe le engwe kadimo go nthishisha gore o ile fela ka moka ke ka mokgwa o o tloba go le rents with cents o ka khona go hwetsa tsibisho ye go rents with cents dot co dot zere go ba go le tlakala la facebook ha go hutleleng paleng ya Gerald ha Gerald ane anze a sebetsa call center malume wa haya ya dulang le sotho o ila hloka hala empa Gerald ha aka a khona ho ya lifungla hai about 3 months into my sebetsa wa ka ha nwana wa ka o la hloka hala ha nka ba ka lifungla hai so itse ha hloka etse kana na wa benyana ne you know at least it's like ha tla mega go le thapo which was the whole cutting of hair um in the un, in the sutu tradition to say look this is what happened so you let him go of the person and just basically releasing their spirit in a sense um bona kana ga benya ne neng ba tla understand ga benya ne neng ke ntwe ke tla metse go ke yetse and also understand the fact that he was sort of immediate family and i had the right ga benya ke you know um how ka ba wetsa la ba lo i informed uh, my manager on time according to the company procedures ga benya ne neng 48 hours ga etsa ka tsile no no but no and then um his superior came into the whole equation saying that no look this is not how things are done but i'm saying look company alone ga khwetsa la ka ka tsile jena and they were just adamant that i can't go i had to come into work that weekend ila ba ho ngala hwa ka ka tsile in that's when i decided you know what i'm done and then three months later i resigned it's a kamara ga ke resigne ne ke sna plan at all as to how am i going to maintain my debt for ana ne ke tlwetsang all i knew was i don't want to be there anymore ha re le banyane re na hana ho re ka etsa eng ka pa eng empa ka nako engwe sena se ka etsa ho re se ke ga bona dintho ha ntle ka mo di leng ka teng Gerald gave up gevoelens en das niks verkeerd om vir gevoelens te lewe nie as jy dit kan bekostig. Maar op die oomblik kan Gerald nie bekostig om enig iets te voel nie. Gerald moet eindelijk by die punt kom waar hy sê verantwoordelikheid moet ek nou neem vir my lewe. Hotel am sê dit so ek ken nou wat jy neem financially speaking it was a dumb decision. It was a very dumb decision financially speaking. Ha hona motho ya batlang ho ba dikolotong a sa sebetse. Ha holo joang motho ya na le ndilene tse mashume a mabedi fela. E ka ba hona le tshepo ya ho re Gerald o tla fumana tsharollo. O shebeletse rents with sense. Le nane ho le etsang ho o nahane ka maemo a hao a chelete. 
ka jelo re shebane le pale ya Gerald Ramuani o hlankana ya dilemo tse mashume a mabedi ya iphumanang a sa sebetse me a le dikolotong tse ngata tse moimetseng ha holo le la pele na le kidu ane lo ana hana tswa le um kidu tse le bona na kwetelele and ne ke sapatale le tho and me wa teng ke motho elo ga benyane neng ke motse pile motho e ke nana ga benyane neng and i think I guess I have been yearning. Um, I'm a burden because I'm born with yearning. I do make an effort, even though I guess I'm busy. Guess I'm busy. 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 Is an empty future, uh, a future that's empty or devoid of purpose, direction, and sometimes quite scary, even devoid of attachment in terms of relationships. So the real, the real cost of debt is poverty, and we, we may find ourselves in a scenario where we actually, we have nothing to show, but nothing to show in the sense of, not just in terms of assets. But nothing to show in terms of quality relationships. Hanga ta chale te ki sona se sosa sa di ntwa le ho sa utlwa ni ka lapeng. Ki tsena di keletso tse ka thusang hore malapa a dule ka khotso go sa khathalatse hore chale te iteng ka pa haiyo. Ndu kwine ba to ambetsana nga haya mapungu. Vathu vanje na ba mutani wabo ba tereza u dzura fhasi bamba nga fungo lo nonga la masheli na hone zwikhwine u amba nga ha thaidzo dza masheli ne ba re nadzo na muta wabo zwifiriswa nga u zwidzumba ha suka tshifinga ba shikoto da thuso kana vhono vha khakhathini u vhela khagala nga ha mafungo a re mara ho nga hi ndi zwifata fulufelo vhukati ne hano na muta wabo zwivuthogwa uri muthu munwe na munwe mutani wabo Asumbuze vudifu hawe nga hama shirini na kushumisele kwao. Vadife chifinga cha utecheles kami umbulo yopambana nao na hone wa ambe voto kumela nga ambono na vudifi haavo. Na hone, wato gumele musibache hazima mashirini kaba tuwa mtani. Wakwatise dze ure vubulini habinyo wana purupero na hone wana tindirano vukati habinyo kakubadele kwa mashirini. Arari wana ukana kana kana ba sa pfisisi ba songo didini kha ba bve khazwo ba pate fulufelo nga u badela tshikorodo tshavho nga tshifinga hezwi a zwi pate fulufelo zwi to uthusa iwe mune uri u tshinyaga thuso kha wa muta u do iwana na hone ba songo hangwa u thusa vhawo ba nga sumbedza uri vhuwa nga u thusa nga dini kana u tanzwa dzigurui dza vhathu vhe vha thusa ba tshinyaga u divha zwinji ngazwo Bangari daela ka rents with sense to see what to say. Can I cast your tarot like you love Facebook? Hara hotel and hotel out. Moshanka na ya shokang tuso ha holo. Ya ipuma na ali di kolotong me asasebet. Rila kabiza di tibi tarona. Hore di kolotu sa moshanka na enwa. Hulu kisa bo pelo ba hae di kolotu sa hae le bo kamo so ba hae. To kick us off, what I'd like you to do is, is have a look at this wheel uh, for me. We call, we call that a wheel of life. And it represents a number of different components or facets that would make up uh, your life. And then rate each section in terms of your level of satisfaction. Uh, the scale is zero to 10, 10 being it's absolutely fulfilling, it couldn't be better, it's great. Zero being it's it's not so good, and then obviously all the numbers in between. If this was a wheel on your car, what would the ride be like? It would be very bumpy. Mm. Yeah. What would be causing the the bumpy ride? <laughs> There's no money. There's really no career. Give me something, one thing that you can do differently that will help you. Yeah. From today. Hustle people to get a job. 
So, so my sense of your energy coming in here when I saw you this morning. Where's your hat? It's right over Can here. Can I have it? Okay. So this is my impression of you this morning when I came in. So Gerald, where's the bag? It's here. And the sunglasses? Okay. So let's come back to This is what I saw this morning. What do you see? It's very, I don't know, I don't care, just yeah. lazy. I don't actually give a damn. Okay. Then, uh, I don't think this can go over my back, but uh, we'll try. So this is how you look this morning. How does the bag look? So I want you to look at the whole, the whole thing. It's very sloppy. Yeah, it's sloppy. So the bag kind of looks like everything else. <laughs> yeah. So so this is this is Gerald going to hustle for a job, XA. Put yourself in the shoes of an employer. What do you think is going to happen? We're probably going to look for somebody else. Why? Because they probably won't trust that I can do what I think I say I can do. Why? Because I don't look the part. Mm. What's the part? I have to look professional, I suppose. Professional? What else? But when I go to job interviews or whatever, I, I'm, I'm, I, like, I prepare myself. Yeah. I have a little pep talk with myself the night Great. before. Nice. And what do you say? I just tell myself, when you wake up, you got this. Great, fantastic. So, and then what happens when you go for the interview? Sometimes I go, sometimes I don't. Um, yeah. You don't go for the interview? For the past four months before I wrote to the show, I'd have interviews come up and I'd think, do I really want to wake up and go do this? Okay, and stop. Not. Don't move. Don't move. Look at what ha what's happening here when you say that. T tell me... How does your body feel when you say that? Because that's literally yeah. how I would feel when yeah. I Yeah, they're like, what's the point of doing this thing? You know, what's you said that right in the beginning. I don't bother with it, so what's the point? So, Gerald, you give up too easily. That's true. Mm. We will maintain a certain kind of energy until we recognize that it's actually not working for us. So, in Gerald's case, hopefully today in the coaching session he's recognized that the energy that he currently brings, hopefully he's recognizing that that energy is not getting the results that he, that he wants and that, that he needs. In his case, what's the brand that he wants to project? What's the energy that he wants to project? And once, he, once we've identified what, what that is, we now understand what the steps are in between that we need to take why it's important to shift our energy, our attitude, our behavior around money and our relationship with money. The how part of, of that equation actually becomes irrelevant. We figure that out for ourselves. Here's another piece of reality for you. How old are you now? I'm 20 years old. Great. Between now and the time that you die, uh, do you think you're gonna be faced with more scenarios where things are out of balance? I hope not, but I think so. Yeah. Well, the reality is, is that life is filled with challenge, pressure, uh, fierce competition. In other words, expect disappointment. So, so if this is me, and here's the event, watch me. This is me. Here's the thing that's happening to me. Okay, it's coming from behind. So, I've been fired. Uh, somebody wants to divorce me. Uh, I've just got a bad performance review. Can I control the thing that's busy happening? Not really, no. no I, you actually have zero. zero control. Do it with me. It's more powerful this way. So, so this is the, the choice as to how you respond is in your hands. You can't control the other thing. Now, what happens when you start to focus your, your energy and your attention on the event? So physically what happens 
is you you start to focus on the event okay the bad boss the bad employer the bad event and notice now where you're looking and now what have you taken your eye off what you can do beautiful it. so you've taken it off where you can go but what what has happened to the thing that's in your power the choice what have you done you've chosen not to have it yeah basically. you've actually given it up you've actually given it up okay so this process is saying that scenario is not ideal yeah but right now you have power in your choice so you can choose to keep the wheel like that or you can choose to have it be different i i, I was not too sure but to be honest I feel like I really can a little, 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 that renewed feeling of having an actually, you know what? I don't have to rather than an do let take a postpone and I win a golf fella. Sometimes you just need to do something, and that's just it. You need to do something because how it's a little Kihona Mon Mota Kakia Timurana. What am I supposed to be doing? Because how it's a little, how it's been out, I'm always saying. On the job front, if I were to give you a challenge right now, on the job front, that would really stretch you, what would it be? I want to be as famous as Jesus, and that's exaggerating it, but yeah. like, that's the truth. You know, we, we are capable of great things in our individual capacities, uh, but Gerald's expectations may be slightly unrealistic in that they're not necessarily aligned to his capability uh, or his skill set. He may in actual fact be, which is a little bit of a concern, he may actually be setting himself up for failure with those huge expectations. who reigns with sense. Mona, SABC2. Ka jeno re xa bana le gore go etsa dikoloto ka bohlaswa o sa tlotelle o ka kenya bophelo ba motho tsietseng e jwang go hlankana enwa ya bitswang Gerald Ramwane o tseba hantle gore go jwang go phela bophelo ba dikoloto tse boima di limong tsa hae tsa mashume a mabedi fela o se a sena mo sebetse mi wi phumana a sena bogoni ba o patala koloto tsa hae jwa le ha for a financial advisor ya rona le yona e ka gona na ho thusa mo hlankana enwa ka mathata a hae a dikoloto Do you know exactly how much you owe? Um when I calculate myself or rather when I estimate it's just probably a little over 20,000. Have you ever written it down? Write down your debt. Stop estimating, stop guessing. Should I like work out how much it is? Write it down. So I have a 3,000 Rand phone that I which took you out, no longer have. which I no longer have, and an 11,000 Rand phone that I also no longer have. Why don't you have the phone anymore? I do not have either of the phones anymore because I lost them on a night out. Why did you take out an 11,000 Rand phone? To be honest, I just took it out because I could. There's no real thought or logic that went out behind it. I just thought taking pictures... So you pictures, found joy in this product? Yes. That you don't have anymore and that you now still have to pay? Yeah. So the joy was short-lived? It was short-lived. Are you currently paying anything? No. Do you have a debit order? It was. It had a debit order on it, yeah. Have you stopped the debit order? I don't think I have, no. Oh, so you're incurring more costs to this phone. So this, co this is not 11,000 rand because every month your debit order goes off and there's insufficient funds in the account that gets added to your negative balance too. Next one, 3,000 rand personal loan. The first one was for my mother to go ahead and pay off whatever she still owed on the loan that she took out originally. So you're a fashion designer? Well, I'm not a fashion designer. I have an interest in fashion though. 
So the 3,000 rand loan which your mom took for you, did you finish the course? No, I didn't. Um, I ended up having to drop out because of financial issues. So what we're actually saying is that at 20,000 rands worth of debt, you have nothing to show for it. Basically, that's the truth. Next one. That one I took out because I could. When last did you pay any of these loans? Um, the one that I took out at African Bank, I was actually paying it month and month, except for the last payment on the account, which defaulted for some reason. I think like I had too many, too much money going out of the account. No, no, no. There's no some reason. Not too much money going out of the account. Well, you didn't have enough money in your account to pay. That. Yes, yes. Gerald, do you think you're making excuses for not paying this debt? Maybe I am, but... No, no, no. Not maybe you are. Okay, I am. That's good. We've acknowledged now that you are making excuses for not paying this debt. If you had said to me, Mushfika, I owe this amount of money because I bought a vehicle and it's standing outside, I could say, fine. I owe this amount of money because I finished my degree. Here it is. I could understand. But all of this was for good times. You are not even making the effort to get in touch with your creditors, am I right? Why are you not making the effort to get in touch with your creditors? I did try, but then I gave up on it. Do you realize that as you put it off, as you put it off, as you put it off, more interest is accumulating on your outstanding balances? Do you know that? I, I do, yes. Your major problem too is that you're unemployed. What are you doing to rectify that situation? Uh, at the moment, my goal is to get a customer service job that pays a reasonable amount. Gerald, I think at 20 years old, you're still very young in life. And I think that all of these decisions, including the decision to leave your job, was very much based on your emotion, on how you felt at that time. How you felt when you saw and heard that you could qualify for an 11,000 rand phone. How you felt when you... I can have 3,000 rands worth of credit for doing absolutely nothing. It's about how you feel, am I right? Yes. Your decisions are emotion-based. I am an emotional person. And there's nothing wrong with that. But you can also be an emotional, responsible person. First of all, we'll go to each and every one of these creditors and make arrangements to pay, even if it is the bare minimum. And Gerald, even if you have to go and work in the Spaza shop and earn a minimal wage, that is what you're going to have to do. Are you prepared to do that? To be quite honest, I'm prepared to do anything. And that's good. That's good. We are starting on a journey of financial responsibility and I'm so proud of you. I'm so proud of you firstly for acknowledging, for acknowledging the fact that you were irresponsible. Because that's a big part of it. You need to know that who you are throughout this life is enough. And from then onwards, you will be able to separate your wants from your needs. The plan moving forward, Kure, Kitlamo Rabinyaneng, Tabili Kifmana Musebezi, that's what the debt counselor said. Kifmana Musebezi doesn't matter now. Upatala Hakai, and then Ki Zame by all means Rabinyaneng, Ki Fonila, Okaike, be in contact with all my creditors, and then Kiba with the Rana Wetzalang, and then ditsang <laughs> Kitsena di top tips tsa o khothatsang ha o ntse o patala koloto tsa hao
Shia Shia. Unga terisi mali ya wehe eka suilele sunga pune kinchumu. Ufaneleke kuu hake la sukwele tiswa wehe. Vitora wehe rita kota kubasi siwa. Unga yenji wuti imiselo zwa wehe zuiwa zikulu. Nkari wotala vanu wa sheketa leso vanga hake la sukwele tile sukulu. Nkari lo uzongo. Loko vata nzeka bahe la matimba. Sungula ikwa hake la suiringanelo eka sukwele tile sukulu. Katani uya eka le sutongo. Hishi hata sukwele tile sutongo sutawa suhirile. Katani utakuma matimba yo hake la le sunga sala. Loko utikuma utikiri wako hake la sukwele ti. Fumele la kuteka goza hulula misa. Tibekele nkari. Kutiba bule hizwa maha kelelo ya sukwele ti swawehe. Suho shabule teri. Suita puna kutiba nsa iso ya sungetelo. Loko ahakela hishi hata. Shohe telela kumabu singarelo. Kuma munu lwei aku singarelaka. Suipuna no shosho tela. Loko unga rena yena. Kuma mula teru wa swatimali aku funi. Kukuma bushosho teri na butivi tuwa mali. Yana eka website ya renswithsense.co.za. Utunzuka no languta Facebook ya hina. Gile gaisa Gerald ho life coach ya rona. Hore imu tuse hore alukisa maemo abu pelo. Le maikutlo ahai. Gabe ga muisa ho financial advisor ya rona. Hore imu tuse ka ulukisa maemo achelet. Eka ba mushanka na enwa, o tla ba le bokamo so bo joa. Ha re khutla. Re tla bona hore e be Gerald a ka khona go etsa Rance with Sense. Hore a tsebe go tswelisa torotsa ha ye pele. Ga le amohela hape ho Rance with Sense, mona SABC2. Ka jeno re shebane le pali ya Gerald Ramuabi. Mo hlankana ya dilemo tse mashume a mabedi. Ya iphumanang a sa sebetse me a le dikolotong tse ngata tse moimetseng ha holo. O se a entse koloto tse fetang tekano ha holo. Ho rileng ga moisa ditsibing tsa rona. Hore ba mothuse hore a tsebe ho laola chalete ya hae hantle. E ka ba bo ka moso ba hae bo eme jwang. Na ga tola ka la dipahlo actually. Thinking about about fashion actually is the fact that I mean, na self personally, I don't, I can style, I can style, but I'm somebody who is visually able to put out the puzzle on. But umbabang, I can pick out things for somebody to wear and they look good. Ufitamo no ni taka kwa la school, taka kwa la school umagrega. Um, I went to college. I hustled kabata pesa rika ifuma na. And then Gatohela. I think then actually yeah, it was me giving up easily as Gary put it earlier. By all means, hot um, having he tried. But I don't think Gilega Lega hard enough. Traditionally it's always been a prerequisite to have um, a fashion diploma behind your name to get into the fashion industry as a designer. However, we are seeing in this day and age that a lot of people are self-taught really in the fashion industry. They access the web a lot to understand the technicalities of garments and actually they are self-taught but they might be working in the industry currently as a retailer, as a shop assistant, in visual merchandising, in a workroom, um, as a pattern maker maybe and they have exposure to fashion and they are self-grooming themselves bottom-up. I think it is important for Gerald to get uh, an uh, on the side, so let's say, for cash cow. Uh, the best option will be to a type of flexi work uh, to do uh, so that he in the day 
sy tyd kan spandeer aan dit wat vir belangrik is uh, en om meer van fashion te kan leer. So is er dat hy miskien uh, whiter werk doen, data capturing werk en so meer. Um, al is dit dat hy vir a retailer, uh, weet soos in oor naweke of, of whatever kan gaan help, dit is belangrik om inkomstestroom te heet terwyl jy bezig is om jou bezigheid van die, die been af te breng. Gile ga kopa live coach ya rona hore e fe Gerald di keletso tsa ho tswelisa ditoro tsa haye pele hantse a lukisa bophelo ba hae What I'd like to see Gerald developing more of is firstly to to make sure that you set realistic goals uh, goals that stretch you slightly but but not to the extent where they're unrealistic uh, so that you know when you get to that point you you don't achieve and you become even more deflated. Secondly, to make sure that those goals are time bound. So by that we mean is, you know, I, I want to be debt free by that date. And then probably the most important thing is to make sure that he has some kind of accountability mechanism or accountability buddy. So that some could be a best friend, could be somebody that he trusts, but somebody that he's going to come back to with feedback at some point and say, listen, I've achieved this goal, why I've been struggling with it and these are the areas that I've been struggling with. Um, and then lastly, very importantly, is to write these things down. Because there is a, a process that happens in the brain where when we commit things on paper, subconsciously we're also committing them uh, to ourselves. ditlolotong <laughs> tsengata <laughs> 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 <laughs>